And we're back! Did you miss us? It's Ellen and Sean playing Dragon Age Shornigens. Oh, you <laughs> missed our puns, did you not? Whether your names are Jeremy or Ryordan, you missed us, you little rapscallions. <laughs> Where'd you Hello get Jeremy again. from? I don't know, just something different to Ray Orton. Oh, you know okay. for where after you're staying for Draken. Oh, who are you? <laughs> he's the he's the Grey Warden that we rescued when we busted out of Fort Draken. No, I don't yes. remember that. Oh yes, I do. Yes. It was very recent. Um Did you know Duncan very well? We went through our joining together. Oh. Whoa. More years ago than I like to remember. I was gonna say He was exactly the same back then. Tough as stone and just as grizzled. You Did you love him? He understood sooner than the rest <laughs> of us how ugly a choice it is to let the few be sacrificed to protect the many. Always left himself a soft spot for his recruits, though. Only way he ever let himself down. Hmm. Um, I need to get Good going. To you, then. Is that a bird behind you? We will have to talk ah, again when the land's I hope is not. <laughs> 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 they didn't render it very well, if so. Is there a bird in there? <laughs> No, just no, a bird cage. Just a bird cage. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, let's let's go talk to Anora. Yes, yeah, talk. She <laughs> <laughs> uh, my room. Ooh, it's right oh. next to your room. <laughs> I like that. It <laughs> 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 so this one's his. Uh, yes. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> oh, damn it! Oh. Your mate is here. Nigella. Oh, Nigella. Nigella in the kitchen. Nigella Thornberry. The Lady Queen has summoned me to see to her unmentionables. Ooh, same oh. with me. Um, this sounds racist, but I think Duanye would say it. There we go. I haven't seen many elves around here. The Chamberlain disapproves of us. Oh. If Lady Isolde hadn't brought me into this household from Redcliffe last year, I'd never have been given a place. Oh. I beg your pardon, sir, but I really can't be mm. seen standing about. The housekeeper will have my head. Oh. Day. Oh, well, that's deeply upsetting. Nora, wait, wait, where are we? Wait. Where'd we go? What? what? Where am I? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Why do we move? I. What, what on earth? Let's go back. Let's go back to the what room. What on earth happened? Magic. What, <laughs> what kind of m magic does this woman possess? Jeez. Uh, okay. So. Left, then yeah. all the way to the end. So here and then here. Yep, there you go. What? That was so odd. Oh, maybe, oh well. she, maybe the idea is like she has to speak in private. I guess. To let us know about our mentionables. Yeah, I think it's just a weird g it glitch. It is good that you came to speak with me. It I is good. I that my actions at Howe's estate may not have painted me in the best light. Yep. <laughs> For that, I apologize and hope that we can start again. All right, I I'll buy it. I can see that your voice will be a strong one in days to come. Yes. It is to you that Eamon listens. Oh, you're going to politicize. And with good reason. My father must be stopped. But once that is done, Ferelden will need a ruler. I would welcome your support for my throne. I don't know about you, Ellen, uh, but I want Alistair. <laughs> okay, you think you're a better candidate than my boy? Do you disagree? Yes. You are a fellow Grey Warden. What do you think of Alistair's mm. potential to rule? Never mind his willingness. I mean, me personally, Alistair has never wanted to be in control. Like, or he's never wanted to lead. That's why we are leading the party, as opposed to him, the more experienced Grey Warden. But also, but, a good leader knows when to follow. But he's also kind. Yeah. Um, being a good ruler requires more than ambition. Alistair seems like a kind, well Yes, man, he is. And enough. Yeah. These are admirable qualities, if not kingly ones. I'm glad you agree. He also seems to be a fine Grey Warden, which is exactly why he should remain one and serve the kingdom by defeating the Darkspawn. Hmm... How do you know so much about him? Kaelin knew of Alistair. <gasps> oh. It was Arl Eamon that kept Alistair out of the courts, as Merrick had desired. Whoa! Though there are some who would follow Alistair out of respect for his Therian blood. The others would see this as Eamon grabbing for power. Who else do you think Alistair would turn to for help? Me. Eventually, the nobility <laughs> would return to the old days of constant warring with each other. Alistair's weakness would destroy everything Merrick built. I think you're laying it on a bit thick because you just want it for yourself. Mm. Well, yeah, I can say that. You just want the throne Ferelden for yourself. Needs an effective ruler with experience to see but I mean, that's not. After. That is not Alistair. Thus, I say again. I, I feel like your for the, the person that goes on the throne is going to depend on which of Ellen and myself is playing at the given yeah, time. Yeah, I don't like I. I just because we have. 
I don't know. It's more because I don't think Alistair wants to do it. <laughs> that I'm like, let's oh force him. Has um, he ever, have you ever done a playthrough where he becomes the king? No, because then he would break up with me. <laughs> <laughs> well, but you don't have that problem here. Yeah, that's true. Um, yeah, because I play it as a mage. So if Alistair becomes king, he cannot have a mage for his queen. Uh, he can, you can only have... You can only ret- retain your relationship with Alistair if you are a noble human. Which, got you. Which, well, we've got our mage Which now. sucks. <laughs> um, but don't forget, there's more than one way to skin a cat. We could, we could have them both rule. Oh, uh, I see. Why should I support For you? For years, I have ruled this kingdom as Caelan's queen. As much as they loved Caelan, all of the Bannon knew this to be so. Hmm. Caelan was a good man. But what is needed now is not another good man, but a good ruler. I sent Alina here not solely because I thought I needed help, but because I saw an opportunity for us both. Miri. I need your support, Warden. And you will need mine. Is that I'm a also threat? thinking I'm also thinking it's very strong for our position to have Logan's own daughter turn against him. I mean, can we not have that but also not have her be the c- queen? Yeah. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. I don't know. That is exactly what I am proposing. When the time comes, you support my bid in the lands meet to remain on the throne. Hmm. You will be seen as my father's enemy, yet you will be in support of his daughter. You will be seen as supporting the interests of Ferelden, as opposed to solely those of the Grey Wardens. In return, I add my voice to yours. Do you see? Together we can do what alone we cannot. Um. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you were ooing at? Ooh, yes. Why not? Ah, uh, marry Alistair. You already married his brother. Yeah. Ignoring that the man looks so much like Caleb. Exactly. <laughs> my recently dead husband, if you'll recall. Yes. My main fear is that he might govern like Caelan as well. well. He, he won't. But it is true that Alistair has their own blood. To some, this is more important even than practical considerations. Mm. A union might be considered a compromise, but... Yes, let's wingman for Alistair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what do you think? I think I could convince him. Yeah, why not? I don't want to say one. <laughs> no, say, go on, say two. Uh, maybe. Let me say this. If Alistair is willing to stand back and allow me to continue governing the nation, then I would be willing to have him as... There you go. This supports, this supports both our <laughs> desires. <laughs> <laughs> if that is so, this is a compromise I can live with. Uh, I will speak to him. Do so. I will be interested to hear what he has to say. You get her on the throne. <laughs> I get him on the throne. <laughs> it. D- I mean, it does. Uh, oh wait, hang on. Uh, who's in that other room? Everyone. Everyone. Sten, dog. Oh I wait, uh, Alistair's down the bottom. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's in Eamon's study. Ah, oh, that makes sense. Because Eamon, Eamon is basically like his father figure. Aww. Also, I am shooketh that Caelan knew about Alistair. And, and deliberately kept the man down. Well, Al Eamon insisted because yes. he knew that Alistair would be used as a pawn for political power. Kind of like how we're doing now. I know, <laughs> right? How good. <laughs> I told Honora I was planning to steal her throne. She has a nasty glare. <laughs> Do you want to turn it into a... <laughs> my idea? I think she's a great queen. As far as I'm concerned, she's welcome to it. Hear me out, Alistair. Ah. Uh, I think you'd be a I great king. I think you'd king. be a great king. Really? <laughs> Whatever will give you that <laughs> He's idea. so sweet. Ah. <laughs> uh, That's true. <laughs> you look snappy with a crown. <laughs> I don't want to ruin this very delicate political, you know, alliance that we may be forging. But also, <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, I'm gonna do it. You look snappy with I the crown. I bet there's a whole new wardrobe that comes as part of the deal. Wow, that Maybe that nice works. No, too. he's quipping with I us. I like that idea. He's just joking. Mind you, then I'd have crown hair all the time. Is that a thing? Can you have crown hair? I bet you can. Of course you can. What do you think I should do? Go ahead and be king. Just marry. Let it happen. Marry her. There we go. I think you should marry Honora. Marry her? As in marriage? As in be her husband? You've spoken to her about this? You did, didn't you? (laughs) Oh, you smart boy. Did you take a blow to the head? Oh, no. That's crazy. Oh, no. Um, 
She can rule while you lead. It's perfect. I think I would go for peace. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Because, I go. mean, it's part of the Grey Warden motto, right? That's true. I think this is the best compromise for peace. <sighs> yes, yes, I suppose you're right. The Landsmeet will probably see that too. <laughs> I love how go uncomfortable ahead, you are with this. Oh, do it. Poor <laughs> Alistair. <laughs> uh, excuse me while I go have a small heart attack somewhere. No big deal, right? You've got big armor. <laughs> I also want to talk to him. I haven't before. been here in a while. They've changed the dining room. Aww. Something on your mind? I have some questions. Of course. Um, look, none of this is immediately relevant, but I'm just aware that maybe we haven't asked this. Yeah. Have you seen the uniform? <laughs> it's not only stylish, but well made. I'm a sucker for good tailoring. Which is why you should be king. <laughs> uh, also. Uh, can't you answer the simple question? I used to be able to, but then the Chantry beat it out of me. Sad but true. I can't hardly get through a pillow fight these days without being overcome with guilt. Do you have many pillow fights, Alistair? Alistair, stop dealing with your trauma via humor. <laughs> so this is where you deflect questions with humor, right? I'd use my shield if I could. Damn it. But I think ah. you might actually spot me hiding behind it. Damn it, he's you too really good. You don't want to know about my being a Templar, do you? It's really quite boring. I love boring. <laughs> uh, yes. Poke, poke, poke. Tell me everything about your life, Alistair. All right, if you insist. It's not like we have anything better to do, right? You have a lot of trauma, don't you, Alistair? Is, yeah. That I did hate going to the monastery. The initiates from poor families thought I put on airs, while the noble ones called me a bastard and ignored me. I felt like Al Eamon had cast me off unwanted, and I was determined to be bitter. But I took some solace in the training itself, I guess. I was actually quite good at it. Aww. Uh, what did you enjoy? The education, mostly. <laughs> but also the discipline. You need to have a disciplined mind in order to use the abilities we have. It was difficult, but rewarding. Nice. Never really felt at home anywhere, though, until I joined the Grey Wardens. And Duncan felt my Templar abilities might be useful for when we encountered Darkspawn magic. So I kept it up. What about you? Do you have anywhere you consider home? Uh, well, um... No, <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> uh, I think he... I don't know. He probably misses being, like, respected and shit. <laughs> or, you like, reckon? you know? He, I think he misses some of the... Yeah. The luxuries that came from being a... Uh, no, the ball. air. Yeah, yeah. I, I miss the lack of air. There's the, too no, much the, oxygen up here. I, I hate mean, it. H e i r. And also, this sun thing is terrible. What is this light? <laughs> not your home anymore, right? You can never go back for good. I think I understand how you feel. I'm Thank you for rubbing it in. Like this, you know? Well, he is the same. What? Once the war is over, once the blight is, well, a time will come. Well, we'll have to think about having a real home again. Together? Though that seems like <laughs> a far ways off. And I suppose the Grey Wardens are gone for good. Either way. Um, They can be rebuilt. I suppose you're right. We can create new Grey Wardens. Black Wardens. But we'll never get back those we lost. White Wardens? Red Wardens. I wonder if it would ever feel the same. Pink. Anyhow, <laughs> no yeah. one sidetracked us. We'd better get back to what we're supposed to be doing. <laughs> Which right is what, now. Alistair? Uh, I just want to. I just want to show get some bonding with my boy before I force him Marry into him an off. unhappy marriage. <laughs> They'll be happy. Well, let me know if there's any assistance I can um, give. You. We have much to do and little time. What do you think he's doing in the Maker alienage? knows what that man is capable of now. Should I get in there? Of course. Yeah. If I might make. No, we did that. Yeah, we've done that. So. Oh, we can tell. Enora that um Oh that Alistair will do it? Yeah. Is there anything I can give Alistair to make him like a me hug. more? <laughs> no, I've got no gifts. No, we've been using him a lot on um Morrigan. Well, yes. <laughs> oh, whoa! Yes, she yes. is all the way up. Uh I don't have any books. No. Okay. <laughs> well, well you did, but oh. you gave it to Morrigan. Whoa, why is Sten Oh, everyone's here. Yeah, everyone's around here yes, somewhere. Yes, I forget. Updog okay. loves us. Um, cool, no worries. Uh, to Anora's room. Yes. Anora. No, that's not the right way. Got you a, hu <laughs> got you a husbo. 
uh, who, a himbo don't husband. worry, he looks exactly the same as your old husband. Which, you know what? It's going to be, you not slip right into so it, be like a not, glove. Not traumatizing at all. Nah. <laughs> well, have you spoken to my lucky betrothed yet? Or will we be reduced to passing notes? Nope, he'll do it. Uh, he's agreed to your terms. I wasn't expecting that, to tell you the truth. Oh, maybe he's... To marry Kaylin's brother. Well, I suppose stranger things have happened. If it will truly help matters... Look, I got... Is this it? <laughs> <laughs> I agree to marry Alistair to retain my throne. And in exchange, I give you my support. If not, then tell me now. That's my compromise. No, yes. I think, yeah, I think we're all down. There we go. Done. We're all down to clown. So we have a deal, <laughs> Warden. I trust you'll keep your end of the bargain. Now, I suppose, comes the task of dealing with my father. That will be no small feat, of course, but I am certain you already know this. I have small I feet. Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything else you needed from me? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Uh, do, you, do, you <laughs> do you need anything? A husband? Uh. <laughs> no. And oh. while I know your concern is hardly disinterested, still, thank you. Uh, that, I, I feel sorry for Anora, but also this is what nobles had to do all the time. Oh, yeah. Of, like, marry well, into the bloodline. Wait, when? <laughs> oh, well. Did you... I think you'll come to like him. Yes. I don't think they will be in love, but I think they could make a strong relationship, if that makes sense. A partnership. Yeah. You don't always... What do you got? Nice. Thanks. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> He's happy about it. He this. got the banner. He agrees that Alistair should marry him. Woof. Because uh. he'll be the ring bearer. <gasps> the ring barker. Oh my god, that would be so cute. <laughs> You'd be like, can you go find something? What are you You'll doing, bring the ring. This is not as defensible as I would like, but it will do. <laughs> yes. Sorry. Oh. Sometimes I can't help but like Sten. I will just discuss something. Speak then. So you... Uh, uh, apparently not. Never involved. mind. I have a question. I surprised. Never mind. Oh, well. Okay. You no, know, I don't think we want to talk All right. to you. Alright. Never mind. Okay, I don't have any dialogue options. I would have been options. funny if you accidentally did the I think you should leave line. If I think you should servant leave. servant asks if I would like a change of clothes, I will set the house on fire. <laughs> oh, wait, actually, what I do have a change of clothes for you. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I would ask you something. So, full of questions. Shut up, up dog. I'm flirting. Uh, yeah, what happens now? Flemeth's dead. Now I have enough time ah. to study Mother's <laughs> grandma to find a way to prevent her from stealing my body in the future. Wait, but she's, she's dead. Be back. Oh. One yeah. day, I have no doubt of that. Well then. And if I cannot protect myself, one day I will track her down again in whatever body she inhabits, and she will die again. And again, if need be. But Ooh. there is no mm. need to think of <laughs> such things now. I have you to thank for saving me, so let us return to the task of dealing with the Darkspawn, no? Um, do you think that you should get some therapy, Morrigan? <laughs> I don't know if it's necessarily healthy to uh, always be, like, your life purpose is to, to track down to and, do kill and kill your mother. Uh, and you think of a way to help thank me. I Think a time shall come when I will repay you. <laughs> oh. Sten's trying very hard not to listen in. <laughs> oh, she disapproves. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hang on. Hang on. So, full of questions. Uh, <laughs> you are very cute to ask so many questions. Uh, I'm glad you think so. And I am glad you are so glad. <laughs> My mother had <laughs> 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 Templar fools Let's get that like approval Alistair, up. which should tell you how successful they generally were. Flemeth made a bit of a game of it, in fact. The Templars would come again, and she would look at me and smile and say that the fun was to begin once more. Um... <laughs> Uh, you had no trouble with them? I am unsure. Hmm. I was too young to understand, and perhaps it was bravado on Plymouth's part. Or perhaps she was merely amused. I will never know. I mean, she can turn into Plymouth a dragon. Warn them it's true. Once. It was a warning they inevitably failed to heed. 
and then the true game began. Often Flemeth would use me as bait, <laughs> a little girl to scream and run and lure the Templars deeper into the wilds. <laughs> I'm in do. danger! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you have so much trauma. I know. <laughs> All of you keep laughing off your trauma. <laughs> it was a game and I a young girl. If I didn't get to play, I would have been very upset. Thankfully, I guess. the wilds is a vast <laughs> place. Once they found us, Flemeth would simply move us elsewhere and we would be lost within the forest once again. I did not understand the danger we faced until I was much older. I had never heard of apostates or maleficarum. Um. I see. I'm just gonna. I'm ride or die with you. They got what they Perhaps deserved. They did. <laughs> Still, I do not begrudge them doing what they believe is necessary. The Chantry sees any mages not leashed to the Circle of Magi as apostates. And apostates could become Maleficarum, evil mages that resort to blood magic and become demon-enslaved abominations. Like your mother? It may even be true. Still, oh. those of us who prefer freedom see no reason to submit. I mean, her mother's a bit different because I think she allowed... She might have allowed a demon in with different terms. Yes. Do you, um, just, do you just agree completely? And then if I were a mage, I might think the same. Hmm. Thank you for small favors, then, at the very least. Enough of this talk. Let us. Okay. Did you approve? You did. Yay! Well, um, if you approve of everything that we've been doing today, uh, feel free to give us a like, give us a subscribe oh, if you <laughs> feel like going any further and uh, uh, taking the relationship to the Patreon level. We do have uh, patreon.com forward slash baby beard for as little as $7 US. Um, otherwise, we keep doing these daily uploads of our YouTube series of Dragon Age and we will continue to do so, including tomorrow when you will next hear us and see us we sure will until that time i've been ellen and i have been sean and i'm Dodge. bye bye <laughs>